So I watched this movie last week, uh, Deadpool, the new Marvel film. So this has a ton of buzz. Obviously, it's I think the quickest, um, largest grossing R-rated film in a long time. So it's it's pretty interesting. It has a pretty inter interesting story behind it. Uh, stars Ryan Reynolds, plays Deadpool. Uh, his name is uh, Wade Wilson um, before he becomes Deadpool. But it has an interesting story because he originally came into this role in the Wolverine movie, the X-Men Origins Wolverine. But everybody hated that movie. It was, it was a pretty bad movie. And his character got very, very altered. The way they did Deadpool in that movie was just really messed up. It was really dumb, I guess, and didn't follow the comic book character like at all. So everybody hated it. And I guess, uh, you know, Ryan Reynolds uh, had been promised a solo film after that, but then the movie did so poorly, it just kind of got dropped. But he kind of stayed on and just continued to campaign for it for a long time. And then eventually, maybe, was it like two years ago, there was some footage that was leaked of a fight scene, and it looked really good, everybody loved it. Um... And so then that kind of got the ball rolling again, I think, and got the movie put back into production. And that scene is actually in the film. It's the uh, freeway scene. I think it starts the movie off and everything. So, yeah, again, it has had a lot of also a lot of hype because it is an R-rated film. Deadpool is a pretty vulgar character in general. Uh, and he's interesting because he always, like, breaks the fourth wall, talking to the audience and stuff. And one of his big things is that he he knows he's a comic book character and so he like he plays with that and it's just supposed to it's just like a really funny a funny character he's called the merc with a mouth um and Ryan Reynolds is a, a good a good choice for that so saw the movie uh I liked it it's really good it's um good good action it's really funny I think it's kind of just refreshing to see a different movie a different type of film especially coming from Marvel it's pretty crazy to see this kind of movie coming out of that studio because uh, there's a lot of violence there's a lot of language uh, a lot of vulgar humor so it's rated r for a reason definitely not for kids you know anybody under i don't know 14 or something i guess the younger kids are probably not going to get all the jokes but i mean they don't they, they really don't hold back so they go for it it's kind of you know kind of surprised about that uh, like i said uh ryan reynolds plays wade wilson deadpool a couple other characters, um, actors, T.J. Miller is like another comic relief, plays a bartender, his friend, uh, Marina Baccarin, Baccarin, I'm not sure what's her name, uh, plays Vanessa, is the love interest, and mm, a couple other characters, uh, Ed Screen uh, is Ajax, he's the villain. So yeah, as far as story goes, it's not super involved or anything crazy, uh, Wade Wilson is a former mercenary, uh, then he meets Vanessa, uh, Marina Baccarin's character, and they, they fall in love, and uh, in this period, they, he finds out he has, like, really aggressive, advanced cancer, like, all over his body, and then the Ajax character, uh, who, who ends up being the villain, uh, gets involved and says that they can you know, save his life and give him these, all these super abilities. And so he asks her, has his procedure done, that's the way he becomes Deadpool, and then he's just kind of going for revenge and trying to get back his girl. It's not a very complex or involved story. It's actually pretty weak, actually. There's not a lot going on. It's only, I think if the movie wasn't as funny and if Ryan Reynolds wasn't as good in the role, it'd be kind of, kind of maybe bad because of the story is just so low-key and uninvolved but um it is really funny it's just i don't know it's just something different um if you're wanting to watch like an action film uh, a different type of marvel film i'll definitely check it out you know it's breaking all these breaking all these records for a reason people are loving it uh i was pretty surprised how popular it was when it came out the other week so um yeah i'm gonna give it a 3.5 out of five. Uh, if you like comic book movies uh, or you just want to see something different, I know I was getting pretty burnt out from them. They come out all the time now, like once a year. Just interesting to see a different type of comic book movie. So 
Um, I'd recommend it. It's good to watch. So yeah, 3.5 out of 5.